Hello! Welcome to Tabletop Bellhop Live. Today is unboxing day. Uh, if you were watching earlier, I did an unboxing of the Kickstarter version of Brass that includes did both Brass Birmingham and Brass Lancashire. Uh, for those of you joining me now, I am going to do an unboxing of this box, another Kickstarter. This should be Endeavor Age of Sail, which is a board game I kickstarted last year. Uh, if you dig this kind of content, join us every Wednesday at 9.30 Eastern Daylight Time, where myself, the Tabletop Bo Bellhop, and Sean, my co-host, talk board games and tabletop games. We generally answer your board gaming questions. You can send questions to questions at, mo or questions at tabletopbellhop.com. But anyway, we're here for an unboxing today. This is a special deal. We don't do these all the time. Love to see you back on Wednesday for our normal show. So here we have the box. Here I have X-Acto Blade. You can use that to open the box. And yes, it is Endeavor. Endeavor Age of Sail. Again, this is the Kickstarter Deluxe Edition. It's a reprint of a classic game from Burnt Island Games and Grand Gamers Guild. It's a two to five player Age of Sail game. Should play in about an hour. I'm guessing longer. This is a very shiny new edition they've created. We'll see just how shiny in a moment. There's some neat water effects on here. I don't know if you can see that on the video, but it's actually reflective. Kind of looks like the box is wet. It's kind of neat. Ooh, lots of trays. Look at these shiny trays. Oh, and little individual ones. I'm gonna guess for player pieces and general resource market. This reminds me a bit of Wasteland Express Delivery Service, and I think it's the same company that does these plastic trays. Then we have a very nice velvet bag with Endeavor and gold on top. We have a little bit of cardboard to punch. Just slide this back. Some spare baggies. Lots and lots of little round bits and some shields. More, more colorful. I see some golden keys, some little chapel looking pieces here. We have the main rule book. Flip through this quick. Looks well laid out, easy to read. I see lots of examples. We have the exploits book, exploits book. I don't know what exploits are, but I see it's the first thing it's gonna explain. I'm guessing these are rule variants. Then we have, oh, how to fit everything in the inserts and where they go, actually very cool. And we start getting to the cardboard. So I'm going to move these out of the way. I'll be putting these down in front. Various buildings, other chits. Ah, some cannons. A giant U. We have a rather thin player board. And then we have... The Age of Sail Charter Company's mini expansion. Now noted this is the Kickstarter expansion edition, so it has some stretch goals. I'm assuming that's one of them. Ooh, these feel nice. Oh yeah, these are way nicer. I don't know if you can see that, but they're double layered player boards. So like scythe, where your resources are gonna stay in space in place there. Hopefully you can kind of see this. Now I will note. 
there is a bit of warping going on there. This is right out of the box. You guys saw me cut the shrink. So while shiny, it looks like probably they put the glue on and didn't quite let it dry long enough. So it's kind of curled up a bit. It's not bad. It's still pretty cool that everything's indented here. These look like they're all the same. We'll speed up to get through the rest of those. All right, I don't know how well you can see this, but vacuum tray with the board, your usual silica pack. And under the board, we have a bunch more stuff. Holy cow, lots of stuff in this game. Let's get the board out here. Two-sided board. Not sure which way is up. Looks like this way is up. So we have a nice two-sided board. Various maps. Looks like work replacement spots. I will admit I don't know too much about this game. I just know the original was very well reviewed and I was very impressed by the components they were showing off for this edition. Other side of the board. All right, lots more components. Lots of chips, looks like they've got some nice printing on them. Uh, these are plastic, little plastic bits. There's cannons, stacks of resources. You have a scorecard, you know it's a heavy game when there's a scorecard. There's a ridiculous number of thick cards here. Not sure what these are, we'll open this up. So a whole bunch of cards. Again, not knowing the game, I couldn't tell you what these are for, but it looks like various ports of call. I could be wrong. We have the crown. Guessing first player token. Some cards. So we have a variety of cards, mostly just symbols. Looks good enough, looks functional. Not very shiny, but functional. Actually, they are kind of shiny. <laughs> all right, and that is everything. I am assuming once we get all this sorted out, we'll know where to put all these different things. We'll put them in the box. So for now, I'm just gonna try to put these back where I got them from. I'm go. not going to punch everything here. Open some of the component bags so they can see the stuff. People want to see the component bags. We can do that. We have little tiny ships. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see these. Various resource tokens of some type. That looks like it's the different things in this bag. There's also some blue, two different symbol tokens. I'm assuming the original these would have been cardboard chits. For now, they're just going back in. Here's some of the plastic pieces. So there's like this really neat kind of plastic keys. Uh, piles of brick, looks like. Cannons. Big plastic plaque ship. Shields. My guess is these are going to be for tracking various levels you have in different things, just by the type of components. Uh, clay pots. And do I see anything else in here? Uh, it looks like gold. That looks like it's all the different types. And then there's more in here. My guess is these probably slot into those player boards, but again, I have not read the rules, so I don't know for sure. to try to fit everything back in here this looks like it'd be great once it's done easy to uh, sort everything everything in its place a place for everything I need to watch the video in reverse so I know what order to put everything back player boards back in 
Oh, Hags of Resources. Those I think were on top. Were they not? Just no, they must have been underneath. No, they were definitely on top. So at this point, I'm not doing like an unpunching video. I'm just going to get these back in here. And close everything up. Bags back in. Shiny trays. Put this bag on top. Toss these instructions on top. Now, I obviously didn't quite put it back right because this is sticking up. So there we are, Endeavor Age of Sail Kickstarter Edition here on the Tabletop Bellhop. That was the end of today's unboxing day. Uh, we do have an earlier video of Brass Lancashire and Birmingham. So I am Mo Tuzano, your Tabletop Bellhop. You can join us every Wednesday at 9.30 Eastern Daylight Time, where Sean and I answer your gaming and game night questions, striving to make your gaming experiences better. Thank you.